Hey, what's up guys? That old dude here again today. Uh, about two months ago, I did a video review on the Asden Pro XD series lavalier mic. So I've had it for two months and I got to tell you, I love it. My videos uh, sound better. Uh, these little tiny things are rugged. Um, I kind of throw them around in my back, in my bag, in my camera bag. And, uh, and guess what? I broke a, a microphone. <laughs> So uh, from do you know from putting it in and out of my shirt, you're wrapping it around things and stuff. I think I pulled the cord too hard, or whatever I did. I don't know. The microphone broke. So I called Asden and said um, they have a they have a U.S. telephone number because they're in the U.S. And I talked to tech support and told them the truth what I did. And uh, he, he asked me, did you did you register your product online? I said yes, sir. So he looked it up and sure enough, yeah, he saw that I registered it two months ago. He said, no problem, I'm gonna send you a new microphone. I said, what? <laughs> so uh, I'll put a card up for my last video. If you remember me talking about a two year warranty, that's, that's unheard of, that's amazing. So um, I, I took it a little step further and I said, hey, uh, I'd really like to try one of your, your higher end microphones with this system. So he said, no problem, I'm gonna send you out the EX507XD, which is the next step up in audio, supposedly, um, that he gave me to do a review on. So that's what today's video is gonna be about. And I took it one step further, and I spent $8 on Amazon and bought a junk lavalier microphone. So we're gonna compare these three microphones. The $8 one, the brand new stock one that they warrantied, and the aftermarket one that's supposedly better than the stock one that's a step up and i'll let your eyes your ears and your eyes be the judge so let's jump in and check it out okay so i've got the uh the lavalier system on with the uh, stock microphone that the uh, xd pro series as in lavalier system wireless lavalier system comes with i've got it hooked up and i'm gonna uh clip it on my lapel and i i think that maybe the way this stock one clips the clip clips on the microphone cable on the cable not on the body of the microphone and that may be how i'm somehow stretching or pulling the the wire all right i can see already that my audio is clipping on my um OMD, olympus omd em16 uh mark ii and uh it's clipping there we go audio uh, <clears throat> so this is the stock this is the way the xd series xd pro series lavalier system comes stock with this microphone all right so i'm going to leave this one attached here and let's unbox the um let's unbox this eight dollar one it comes just like this i think the box is nicer than than how the microphone feels the cord is very very thin on this uh microphone it's nice and long um, but it's very thin now see this clip clips on the base of the microphone and not on the cable itself. So um, again, I don't know if that's how I'm breaking mine or not. So uh, we're gonna unplug this microphone and it might, it might pop, I'm sorry for that. Now we're gonna plug that $8 microphone in and clip this on my lapel in generally the same spot. <clears throat> And I, I can already see by the levels on my camera that this microphone is super hot. It's picking up everything. It's picking up the cars driving by out my window. Again, this is the $8 microphone uh, that I bought from, um, from Amazon for $8.49 says compatible with iPhone, iPad, iTouch, Android, Windows smartphones and more. So uh, I can already tell that this is a horrible microphone. I'm going to take it off my lapel and I want to pull this foam off and 
and have a look at the oh see that's why the microphone has side inputs a little side grill so it's actually picking up side noise as well to my knowledge a lavalier mic really shouldn't have those you want a lavalier mic to be more directional towards you only and cancel out all the noise around you uh, when you're doing a vlog like this or something I would hear that motorcycle I would imagine that you would want only your voice uh, when you're narrating narrating especially I would imagine you only want your voice so uh, and I, I'm sorry for the popping noise but I'm gonna pull this jack out it's gonna pop okay and then uh, we're gonna put the stock one back in the stock one's back in now and uh, I'm not going to say anything. Let's, the cars are going by. Let's see if you can hear them. Yeah, nothing. I got tons of cars right out my window driving by on a busy street. So, okay. So, uh, I'm already convinced that $8, you get what you pay for. And for 8 bucks, if that's what you can afford, hey, you know, that's all you can afford. And, and that's, it's a great start. It's a great way to get started if you're recording audio through your, through your smartphone or, or, or whatever. Um, um, but for eight bucks, uh, as thin as this cord is, I'm sure I would break this in a heartbeat. And the audio to me is horrible. So uh, let's go ahead and open up this brand new uh, package that Asden sent me. Then again, this is the um, EX507 XD. It's a step up from their stock microphone lavalier microphone that comes with the um asden xd pro and uh let's see well already i can tell you just by feel and sight that the cord on this is thicker yet more than the cord that comes on the stock uh, lavalier microphone so already it's more heavy duty and um, let's see how long it is about the same length and then now um, let's have a look at this clip the clip feels much heavier it's uh, more metalized than the uh, definitely than than the one that came with the uh, eight dollar one but even more so with the stock one that comes with the uh, asden xd series um lavalier wireless lavalier system um this is yeah, this is much nicer <clears throat> and uh, i'm noticing that the clip on this one now clips to clips to the body of the microphone rather than the cable which to me, I think that's a lot going to be a lot more secure. And this cable, these cables are small, and if they get yanked on when you're wearing them or something, um, I think that's gonna. That's probably what happened to my original one was I yanked on it, and it ripped it out. Okay, so I'm going to hook this right next to that lavalier system, lavalier. And again, I apologize. You're going to get a popping noise. But I want you to pay close attention, not only to any background noise, but also my audio. If it, if it changes, does it get louder? Does it get softer? Does it get deeper? Does it get higher? Like, it, like is it, are you in a tin can? Are you in a, uh, uh, um, a cave, like an echo or reverb or anything? So again, it's going to pop, and I apologize. Um, so here we go. This is on the stock lavalier system, audio 123. Audio 123, I'm that old dude making a video on uh, lavalier microphones by Asden. And now I've plugged a new one in, audio 123, audio 123. Is it echoey? Is it deeper? Is it higher? Does it sound like I'm in a tin can? Can you hear the difference? Does the quality justify the extra twenty or thirty dollars more for this? Uh, that Asden's claiming that this mic, the uh, 
EX507 XD. Uh, it says it's it's designed to vastly enhance the audio quality of the Pro XD wireless system. And it is also compatible with mobile devices uh, that have TRRS inputs, which is iPhones for sure and, and other phones as well. So, uh, so this is the uh, step up microphone, the, the uh, better microphone as in claims, the EX507XD. And I'm gonna unplug it so it's gonna pop. And now I've plugged in the stock microphone that comes with the uh, Asden Pro XD series, which by the way is less than $200. So uh, you can watch my review that I left, uh, that I'll leave another card up top for or put a link in the bottom. But um, I've seen, uh, what made me buy this was because I believe in, in buying the best the first time. And I saw a lot of reviews on some $80 wireless uh, lavalier systems that just didn't look they offered all these functions numbers up and numbers down and all these different channels and all that look I just want to make uh, good quality videos with good audio and uh, I don't need a bunch of buttons and whistles and bells and whistles to to make good audio I just need a, a good lavalier system by an American made company who knows who's been around for a long time and knows what they're doing so I'm going to unplug the stock microphone again. And again, this is the aftermarket one uh, microphone, the EX507XD. I'm sure you'll agree in the quality. It's, 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 it sounds more, uh, uh, more professional, don't you think? It's a bit deeper. It's a bit um, broader, I guess, is the word I'm looking for and my tone of voice um and you don't hear cars going by <laughs> well you really didn't hear them going by with the stock one either it's these junk ones you really gotta for eight dollars look you get what you pay for and uh but if that's all you can afford then i understand um but if you if you could hold off and save your money for another month or two and buy the asden pro xd you won't be disappointed i i swear I, I i love mine and uh my olympus omd em1 mark ii loves it and it looks really cool on there and very professional so i hope this video helped you out um i'm super happy uh with the audio from this thing because i've already listened to to it uh off camera so um i'm gonna stick with this one and use the uh stock one that came with it as a backup and uh and this $8 one, uh, if somebody wants it, email me and I'll send it to you for free. So uh, please like and subscribe my channel, uh, subscribe to the channel, and look for future videos on more audio, video, uh, drones, computers, all kinds of stuff coming your way. Thanks for watching.